Hosting a mortgage for someone else is like buying them cigarettes. Here's why. Imagine I walk into a shop and I want to buy some cigarettes, but I don't have my ID. You agree that it's okay because you remembered your ID, so you'll buy them for me. So you go to the shopkeeper. The shopkeeper says you have to buy two things, not just cigarettes, but also some debt. And your cigarettes are really, really expensive. They're like a hundred thousand pounds for one pack. The shopkeeper says, yes, she'll give you some debt, but only 75% of the value of these super expensive cigarettes that you're trying to buy. I don't have my ID, but I have a ton of banknotes in my wallet. So I give you the rest of the cash. You put together the debt and the cash and you exchange those two for the packet of cigarettes. You give the cigarettes to me. We agree firmly 100%. These are my cigarettes, not yours. Then I pay you every month so you can go and service the debt. Keep that shopkeeper happy. That's how leverage works. You have debt. I have lung cancer. Everybody wins. Follow me for more.